Hello everyone. Today I'm playing Farming Simulator 2013 and this is going to be a side let's play to pick one two. Um so ignore these two, we're just going to be starting these. We're going to go so easy provides you with a more starting capital and a comparatively small bank loan. Completing missions to have more money and higher resistance is less costly. Normal is the best choice for most players in this big game. If you're looking for a challenge, try the hard difficulty. Start out with less money and to make things worse, you're already in debt at the bank. Great. You get, you get smaller roles for completing missions and hiring assistants costs a lot more. So we're probably going to go just for normal. I, I always used to go for easy, but. You know, no. I get back, and I might be able to um, get some friends along to help me. So uh, I might start a server soon. Um, I'll tell you, I'll, there's gonna be bleh. <laughs> okay. Um, I'll do. I'll make a server. On my final save game. And you guys can uh, join and uh, play. So, yeah. So, uh, when this loads, we'll uh, start playing. Come on. Come on. Get down. Get, get on. Okay. Anyway. When this loads, we are going to be uh, looking at the introductory trips to the game. So I just have to move some stuff. My bed is really messy. And uh, you're actually sitting up there. Unluckily, you can't see me. You can only see the green, green, green. I should be reading this. Start your career now and discover the numerous fields of activity of a modern farmer. In this game mode, you are completely free to decide what tasks you want to pursue. Do you want to purchase new fields to expand your farm? Do you want to increase your livestock? Or do you want to invest your hard-earned cash in new machinery? The decision is yours. With the right amount of skill and diligence, you can soon become one of the most successful farmers across the country. Dive right into the multifaceted world of agriculture. I can read the alcohol as is that multifaceted? Multifaced it. Anyway, but that's, this is Germany, so it's probably mostly German names. So if you're from Germany and I'm pronouncing stuff wrong, um, seconds. Okay, I know if you're on one frame per second now. It's really annoying. Like, come on, load. How long has this been loading for? Ah. So, uh, no, this is nothing like Minecraft to say. Basically, you use W to move forward, just like you do in Minecraft. <gasps> Run over! Okay, welcome, this is your new farm. Follow the gravel path to the left and get to the main area. There you can find more interactive tips to the game. Now, my graphics card isn't that good. I literally. Oh, it's a butterfly. Oh, yeah, we killed the butterfly. Oh, I'm trying to play Minecraft here. Uh, basically, or you can just like skip and just press tab and then E and then you're in. Yeah. Basically, you get two weights, three tractors, a trailer, a sewing machine, a cultivator, and a plow. And walking in this game isn't very fast, so we're going to take the track. I'm lazy. And starting up stuff in this game kind of hard. And I'm going to talk over the weights. How stupid. Um so yeah. Might get into the farming bit of this. Um yeah, so this is Fuel. Uh, if a vehicle's gas tank is empty, gets empty, you can refill it at the spot. There are more gas stations at the village, at the farm shop, and the spin and the spinnery. Spinner is where you deliver wool. Simple as that. And once I've done all this, I will show you the shop. And then, uh, yeah, basically you just go in a clock. Oops. You've already read that. 
And great, we have a rooster. But it's going to annoy us. Great. Oh, uh, I think it's in here. And I think if you press I, yeah, you get a PDA. Press 9 on this one, it'll zoom out. So I again, you get weather forecast. You press 9, even more, you get. I can't wait till uh, Monday. As you, uh, <laughs> um, your chicken shack, as soon as you buy some chickens, they get delivered right at his spot. Chickens lay eggs, which you can sell at the village or, or at the farm shop. Now, farm shop, I'll show you in a minute. Anyway, there's prices, which basically, I don't know what the hours mean. If you know what the hours means, tell me, because I don't know. Now, uh, great demands. Now, some, because all of the, um, Places are comparing the farm shop, the freight yard, the in the mill, and the port. They're all, you know, so they they want to give out the most money for the most stuff. They're all competing. So right, sometimes the money will go up. Um. Now in easy, a lot of stuff is like you get Drake make bleh, great demands very often. Normal, you don't really get them. Hard, I think you get them as like a one in a thousand chance you get them. I've never played in hard. Oh, come on. So anyway, silos. These silos are for temporary storage of your commodities. Drive over the unloading spot with a full trailer and unloaded contents. A symbol is displayed to the right as soon as you are in position to start unloading. To retrieve the commodity from storage, Position a trailer below the corresponding silo. The trailer will be loaded into its floor until the storage is empty. This is taking way too long. Oh, for goodness. I'm hardly going at any frames per second here, so. The video lags, then. I'm sorry. I'm lagging. Well, I'm not lagging. It's just that this stuff. It's a wild to start. Anyway, can you just drive through it? Like a, if I can, then can you just kill myself? Um, yes, you can. Getting rid of straw and hay. If you have a surplus of straw or hay bales, you can place them here and get some money in return. So yeah, but we can't we can't make bales now because I've got a bale and I've got a bale picker up. And this tractor is very noisy. I'm going to turn my volume down. Um, so you can hear my voice, you know what I mean. Um, fertilize. Drive this, drive to this tank to fill your sprays or spreaders fertilize. During the filling process, money deducts from your account. You can find similar tanks at the garden centre and at the farm shop. I don't know where the garden centre is. If you could, like, tell me where it is, I'd be so grateful. Um, yeah, anyway, so I think this is seeds. It's been a while since I've played this, I've just been watching videos today. Um, see, so did you have the coins spare? You can refill your sewing machines at these pallets. Same pallets can also, can also be found at the garden centre and the farm shop. Now, I, I have a 10 minute limit. So you have to buy a bandy cam to make over. So, potatoes and sugar beets. Store your potatoes and sugar beets by unloading them here. So you can there, but so loaded behind the wall where you can fill your trailers. Right, I think that's all the question marks. And now, if we tap into not the grand ID, and oh my god, okay, that scared me. It's like God's ghost tractor. Oh my god, it's like in um, what, what, what's that film called? The ghost tractor or something. Um, anyway, keep tabbing. Yeah, here we go. Uh, this is your combine after. Now, if you press H, hire a worker and they'll do it for you. This is probably the best way. Oh, yeah, but I'll show you all these areas in the next episode. Um, so, yeah. Things are going to be updated once a week. Uh, so, yeah. I'll play this once a week and upload it once a week. Um, I think I'll upload it today. Now, just saying, I'm. Um, yeah, my, uh, yeah, I can't really say it, anyway, just basically get, attach this to your, your 